Hey guys, Andy here, and today I'm going to teach you how to automatically remove pauses and filler words in Adobe Premiere Pro. So before we begin, we must transcribe our video, and in order to do that, we must activate the text window. So to do that, we go up to Window, and go down to Text, and then click on it. So right now you see the little check mark right there, so I already have it activated, but if you don't, that's how you do it. And then you go to your text window, which I have located right here, go to Transcript. And it says here you have two sources. So the 13 Taco Bell sound variants is a sound effect that I use. So we're just going to uncheck that. And we're just going to have the Eric Mealtime 1.wave checked because that's the main audio source here. And then we're going to click on transcribe. Now this might take a few minutes depending on how long the project is. So just hang tight. All right. So now we have our transcript settled out here. And as you can see, it transcripted the entire conversation. And if you look closely, they have little ellipses here. And it even tells you the length of the ellipses. So in order to automatically eliminate the pauses and filler words, we simply go up to this little eyedropper type tool. Click on that. And it presents a drop down menu showing text, filler words, pauses, and search settings. Now. Before we get into filler words and pauses, I want to show you the different search settings that you can put in. So you have the transcript view right here. So it shows the different things that it looks for, like filler words, for instance, low confidence words, untranscribed sources, speakers, pauses. And you can adjust the minimum pause length. Me personally, I found that having it at the maximum length of two and a half seconds works the best because if you have it any less, then I find that it cuts just a little too suddenly. So it's good to have just a little bit of pause, but not too much. So just have it at the maximum length possible for the minimum pause length and you'll be good to go. So go ahead, click save, go ahead, go to filler words. And in this video, it has 44 results. So go up to delete and you can choose to delete all or just delete a specific word. And there's two ways to do it. You can either extract it or lift it. If you lift it, it'll just leave a big space where you deleted it. But if you extract it, it will fill in that space. So it's kind of the difference between a ripple delete and just a regular delete. So I'll show you what it looks like when you lift. And then we'll move on to extract, which is my preferred method. So I'll click on lift and click delete all. And if you zoom in closely, you can see that when you do lift, it just leaves all these gaps. So we'll go ahead and do that. Then we'll go back and we'll click on extract instead. Hit delete all. And as you can see, there are no gaps. And now to eliminate the pauses, all we have to do is simply go up to the eyedropper tool here, go to pauses, Click delete, make sure extract is ticked, and then hit delete all. And it's just that easy. So yeah, that's how you can automatically remove all filler words and pauses in Adobe Premiere Pro. If you liked this tutorial, be sure to give a like and subscribe for more tutorials. And if you have a question about Adobe Premiere Pro, be sure to leave it in the comments down below and your question could be the next tutorial. This is Andy, signing off for now. And as always, we'll see you next time. Bye guys.